Good morning, Lego fans. Welcome back to another mock roundup. Uh, it's been quite a long time since I've done one of these videos, and uh, yeah, I had other things in my mind, um, at, as you can see. Uh, but yeah, anyway, uh, today we're going to be doing a mock remix. Uh, basically, we're going to be taking this vehicle and we're going to pimp it out. This is basically the Hypno Cruiser from 1996, the Time Cruiser series. Uh, it has a lot of mobile function. And it's a vehicle I really enjoy. It's one of those uh, vehicles uh, that I just kind of leave up on my shelf and enjoy all year round. Uh, this is my Primo, uh, never been scratched, never been really played with uh, Hypno Cruiser. And so, as such, uh, I just kind of keep it in pristine condition, um, away from sunlight and whatnot. Uh, but yeah, uh, I just basically wanted to see if I can make a sort of uh, Time Cruiser-esque vehicle using the same parts uh, as this vehicle. Um, back before they actually had the 3 one theme like they do today, they had uh, a variety of different builds you can have on the very back of each box. Um, and you could try to build those things. Of course, they wouldn't have any instructions or anything. Uh, but it was really kind of interesting to build um, using the using your imagination and the parts that you get in the box. That's really quite, uh, quite ingenious. Um, so yeah, I wanted to see if I could do something similar with uh, the Hypno Cruiser here. Um, but simply put, they didn't have any of these things on the very back of the uh, Time Cruisers series. Um, <clears throat> excuse me. Um, so yeah, so I decided to... Um, make my own. So instead of the Hypno Cruiser, which is kind of like a time traveling uh, vehicle, uh, maybe maybe a car of some type, uh, but not legally a uh, binding car, of course, uh, because I, I don't know, two guys time traveling through uh, uh, in, a, in a car that has uh, doors that flip up. Hmm. Very suspicious there, guys. Uh, definitely inspired by something pop culture. And anyway, 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 moving on. Instead of a car, I wanted to see if I had to build something else, vehicle-ish, and still have, like, the moving compartments. So, uh, I give to you the Hypno Helicopter. Here, let's get a better shot of that. Hypno Helicopter. Woo! Uh, I really enjoy... I really... Here, get out of here. Get out of here, old news. Get out of here, old news. Here. There we go. Woo. Uh, so, yeah, here we go. Yeah, yeah, isn't that cool? Uh, so yeah, I basically use the same parts, um, and uh, <laughs> I only have really have room for for the professor inside here now. Uh, Tim Cruise can just sit off to the side. Meanwhile, the professor goes on adventures himself. Uh, maybe uh, searching for Tim, uh, lost in time, and uh, who knows? Uh, but yeah, so as you can see, uh, he uses a lot of the same parts. Only had a very small number of uh, things left over. Um, we have the main fly belt instead of being on the front it's now on the very back and it it controls the propeller up top um, I wish there were more moving parts that I could get going uh, but unfortunately I couldn't I couldn't figure out how uh, but as it is I think it's a really fun toy a fun remix really uh, because it still has the flying capabilities uh, as well as the rolling capabilities a lot of imagination there um, yeah so yeah I just want to showcase some of my favorite uh, Lego theme and uh, showcase how I can potentially mix it up, uh, since I'm all about mixing things up lately. <laughs> uh, yeah, anyway, uh, if you like what you see, uh, please leave a like and subscribe, and uh, yeah, I'm sure I'll find something else to showcase. And until then, bye!